Detail World, Detail World, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We done made it to this first stop, man. We out here in uh, Green Hill, Tennessee right now. We about to do this toy Oda. Yep, no, this is a land cruise. This is a Toyota land cruise. But uh, we here at the first stop. Man, excuse me, man. I lost, like, my phone got stolen yesterday. So, man, mentally, I just all over the place because they give me a hard time to get a new phone. They want me to fill out an affidavit and all this crazy stuff, man. So, I still ain't got my phone back. But we are right here at the second first stop. We're doing this Toyota, like I said. Already working on the interior. I'm about to work on the exterior. You see the brake dust on these cars. Look, brake dust is heavy, man. But we're going to go ahead and work on this exterior real quick. Already got the interior uh, knocked out and things like that. Uh, the is working on the other side. We already got the majority of this side knocked out things like that. We just need to come through in here and get the, the door jams things like that. Come on, the monitor. about to go ahead and do it, do what we gotta do so I can go ahead and knock these other cars out. I think I got two or three more vehicles and I need to get to a FedEx or UPS so I can handle this stuff, man. But, like always, man, do what you gotta do, man. I appreciate y'all, like always, man. I know the channel seems just all over the place, man, but we just trying to figure out what's best on the channel. We will continue doing the vlogs, kids being kids, around Nashville, just trying to find other entrepreneurs to interview and things like that. But, like always, man, I'm going to do what I got to do. So do what you got to do, man. Hit that subscribe button. Leave a like. Share. Comment. Turn on all post notifications. Put that thumbs up, man. Definitely hit that thumbs up, man. And I'm going to catch y'all in a minute. Hey. Detail world. Detail world. What it do, what it do, what it do, man. We just finished this Toyota Land Cruiser. Yeah, we just finished it up. Like I said, we had to do a basic interior exterior even though it was a little bit dirty inside man we still got it knocked out had a little bit more dog hair like i said that dog hair sometimes makes it seem like it's much more work than what it is and then like i said when people got small kids the kids just be so just unaware of how dirty they get in the car but you remember what it looked like man the car was dirty it had dirt all on the seats dirt all on the doors dirt all piled up right here y'all remember had a baby dog right there but we got it completely knocked out. Car came out fantastic. We about to head to the next stop. Like I say, we running a little bit behind because I had to drop the kids off to school, plus my oldest daughter off to school, plus the grandbaby at daycare. So it was a lot of traveling. But we are out here. Once again, I lost it. My phone got stolen yesterday, so I'm, I am phoneless. So I know a lot of people are probably blowing my phone up and probably missing a point in the arm type of that. I mean, Verizon gives me a hard time to get a phone. They want me to sign an affidavit, so proof of ID and all this other crap. But I'm gonna go ahead and get that crack. I got two more cars I said I need to go ahead and knock out so I can go ahead and get this phone back and things like that. But like always, man, I'm gonna continue to do what I gotta do, man. I'm gonna do my due diligence. So do your due diligence, man. Hit that subscribe button. Leave a like, leave a share, comment, and I'm gonna get back with you in a minute. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do. I know y'all like, man, you just did this car the other day, yeah. We just did this car, but that's like I tell y'all, that's the reason about being in business, man. Consistency is the key to everything, man. As long as you're consistent, you can't fail. Sound like she put in her other car. Huh? Oh, okay. All right, well, we're about to go ahead and do this GMC Yukon Dinati. She got two young boys, and I promise you, these little boys know how to keep this car dirty, man. I swear. Hopefully, I found some candy in here, man. I'm brother need a snack. We got that Z bar. We ain't eating that crap. I want a snicker. Uh, go ahead and knock it out, man. Get this interior going. Exterior going. You know what I mean? Not really that bad. That's your typical debris. Sticks, twigs, dirt, kid stuff. You got that bug. You got that, what's that bug, buddy? That's pretty cool. You know that is pretty cool right there. But, uh, yeah, but that's, you know. That's all, folks. I'll catch y'all in a minute, dude. No, you ain't gonna say no peace. No choice the rest of this car, man. What are you doing? But, like always, man, do what you gotta do and I'm gonna do what I gotta do, man. Hit that subscribe button, leave a like, share this video, and I'm gonna catch you in a minute, man. Peace. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, man. We just knocked out the GMC Yukon Denali. We got it all nice and 
Biffy looking nice and clean, nice and clean. You already know what I mean. But uh, yeah, she wanted to get it knocked out. She wanted her carpet shampoo, so we went ahead and shampooed the carpets up, things like that. Make sure we gave it a good interior cleaning. Make sure we clean these seats real thoroughly, and make sure that we gave it a good shampooing, good cleaning, heavy duty. You know what I mean? But we finished here. We about to head to the next stop right now. We just knocked some fire. because I don't have my phone to see if anybody else wants to get on my schedule today. But I need to finish anyway so I can go ahead and try to get my phone back and everything like that. But I hope y'all all doing well, man. And like always, you already know the script. You already know. You already know. I know y'all like, dude, you a singer now? Yeah, I sing. I'm R&D. Rhythm and detailing. But I'll catch y'all in a minute. Peace. Detail world, detail world, what to do, what to do, what to do, man. We made it to the last stop. Uh, we've been here for a while. We already knocking out the interior of this Porsche Cayenne. Already got this side, this side actually done. Killer Cow working on the other side. I'm about to go ahead and start working on this exterior of the car so I can get home, so I can go ahead and get this paperwork started on getting my phone back, man. So if I can get it in by the day, they can send me a new phone today. But I'm out here in Bell Me. It's a beautiful day. Been cloudy all day, so. So I haven't really been out. But let me give you a quick glimpse of the interior of this car. Like I said, we already got it knocked out on this side. Killer Cow's doing the other side. Gonna yeah. uh, go ahead and knock it out, do what we do best, man. But in that process, man, y'all take notes. Y'all like what I'm doing, let me know, man. Leave a comment, man. I'm definitely moving the seat back right now. But, uh, Kevin Hart playing on the radio right now, so yeah, this is a little comedy while we clean this copy and have my hair set. But, like always, y'all, I'm gonna do what I gotta do, do what you gotta do, man. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, leave a like, comment on this video, man, and like always, yeah. Detail world, detail world, what it do, what it do, what it do, and what it do, do. We just watch the car, and whatever bird just flew over the car, just poop right there, but. We just got it all knocked out real quick, man. We had to do a, a good interior, exterior detail on this set. Inside was a little dirty, man. You know, he just bought the car used, so it had dirt everywhere, all in the cracks and crevices. But you already know how that go, man. Ain't nothing we can't handle over here. If you see the wheels, wheels came out good. Interior of the car came out swell. Like I said, we had the interior shampoo the inside, things like that. So if you see the carpet, it got. It looked like it been hit a little bit, but you know what I mean? When you go to wipe this certain stuff down, like I just went back and wiped down with the um, with the uh, with the um, leather conditioner. Most of the time, sometimes the towels, if you don't use a new towel, it may got old debris into the towel. So when I was wiping the leather conditioner on the towel, the little debris that was in the towel, if you can see it, it was dropping a little stuff on the carpet here and there. But that's nothing that, not a major problem. You see the car completely is clean. You know what I mean? Only thing that's left to do is uh, just pump it. You know what I mean? We already put the tires on the tires. Already put the cracks on. Already did the windows. Already did the leather condition and things like that. It would have been a much older car. Sometimes it may take a little bit more saturation because you know they got these preparated seats. So sometimes you may have to spray a little bit more on there than usual. But like I said, it's really not too much you can really do. It's because most of the moisture starts soaking into these holes. You see, I got all these little small holes and stuff like that. So the majority of you see it kind of got like a little crazy looking shadow of it. But that's because the leather conditioner went inside the holes. And then, I guess, that's, but that's always been like that when I do car, two cars like this. It's because of the, the holes in the seat. But uh, like I said, we completely got it done. I'm just go around it one more time and make sure I don't have any water spots. Like I said, the birds boo-booed on the front of the car. So I gotta get this bird from you off. But other than that, man, we completely finished here for the day. This is the last time. You know, like I always man, take pride in whatever you do, man. No matter what it's doing. If you just washing hair, washing dogs, cleaning gutters, whatever, man. But like always, man, show yourself one love. Take that picture, because we all need a little love. And like always, man, you're gonna need a little bit of peace.